Hey everybody, welcome to another After Effects CS6 tutorial. My name is Buddy Blackford, and I'll be your host for this tutorial. And this time we're going to be talking about navigating uh, the presets through Adobe Bridge and adding them to your video footage or your text or whatever layer you want to add them to. And this last time I made an Adobe Bridge, Bridge tutorial, I only showed you the text presets, but there's a whole bunch more. There's effects for different, like these effects that are up here, that there's a whole bunch of those kind of stuff. So I took this video the other day, me and Bucky and uh, Tim, we went fishing and uh, we both, we all caught like a bunch of bass, but it's not bass season, so we, we let them all go. But um, we would let them all go anyways, because, I don't know, I don't know, it's more sportsman-y to me, but um, it was pretty fun, We and Bucky caught a huge bass using a frog. So um, I'll just show you the video real quick, because you guys like that kind of stuff, so let's play this video. It's got some sound, and it's got me being really, really excited in it, but here we go. Big key, boys. Oh my god. Oh yeah! <laughs> <laughs> You got your pliers? Mm -hmm. Nope. <laughs> Is this even measuring tape? You taking a picture or video? Video. Are you using After Effects? Oh, <laughs> look at that. Hell yeah. That is one nice fish. Good, that's it. Wait, I want to eat it. So, yep, that's the video, and that was probably that was the biggest fish anybody caught that whole time. I caught the most fish though. He caught the biggest one, but he was uh, he was using like a bigger bait to catch like the bigger fish. And uh, the season doesn't start until like I think it's like the third Saturday of um, of June, so. The 27th. No, the 20th. That's when it'll start. That's not Saturday. The 21st. Jeez. But anyway, let's get on to using our Adobe Bridge to um, use uh, put effects on here. <clears throat> so the way we're going to do this is select our layer. Then come up to Animation, and we're going to go to Browse Presets. And it pretty much always opens... Oh, I already did. It'll open up Bridge for you and it'll come to this page right here and it opens usually up to this uh, After Effects CS6 support files presets section. Now we've got a bunch of uh, color correction presets here and uh, these are the presets that I have uh, added myself and put into this folder. So you won't have this one right here um, but you'll have these other ones such as backgrounds, behaviors, image special effects so let's, let's go into uh, image special effects and see what's in there. We've got bad TV, bad TV 2. So um, let's just throw uh, one of these on here. Let's go to, uh, <clears throat> let's just try bad TV 2 because it's green colored. Double click on the effect and it, well, yeah, it'll apply it. It's uh, frozen right now, so I'll pause it real quick until it unfreezes. Alright, now we've got the bad TV effect on there. Didn't really freeze it, just like, I guess it froze for just like a couple seconds, but this is what the uh, bad TV effect does. And it's pretty easy that you can just add this on there. So let's check out our effects controls panel and see what we've got on there. Wave warp, box blur, color balance, noise, Venetian blinds. So um, it added all those presets on there. Now if I type in <clears throat> UU, we can see all the um, everything that's been changed in our layer. So just type in UU real quick on the layer, and it brings up all these. These are all the parameters that have been changed. And um, the position, scale, and rotation are things that I changed and not the, the uh, preset didn't change those. So we've got our effects here that have been added. So let's uh, go ahead and just throw something else on to see what else we can do and we can uh, play around with this and mess with it. So you can see that the different uh, things we got going on here in, in, the, uh, in the special effects. 
Let's go to creative and see what they got here. Um, some colorize. Um, insert video framed, grayscale, vignette lighting. Let's put that on. Let's put mood lighting streaks. Ooh. You can barely see it on there because the video is so bright. What a great one for me to pick, geez. Let's hit you. And um, you can see in this one, they have. Uh, let me hit you, you. Um, you can see in this one they've used expressions within their th uh, effects and they're uh, linked to the different effects that they already have in there. So that's uh, pretty cool. So you can even get expressions within your effects uh, animation presets and effects presets that they made for you. So um, that's uh, that's pretty much it about this tutorial. There's You can uh, browse through all the different things on here in, and uh, check out their different previews of what they've got going on and um, just like check them out in bridge so thanks for watching this one now you know how to use these uh, presets be careful when you're using these all the time though because um, since they do come with Adobe and they have been in there since like CS4 at least or maybe CS5 uh, people recognize some of these presets and they might be like oh you didn't make this on your own or whatever um, some people care about it, some people don't. Just keep that in mind. So thanks for watching this one. I'll uh, see you guys later. Have a good one.